Prepare the gutter flashings for installation. Using a small piece of scrap material, extend the angle from the fold on the between post suspension bracket to mark it toward the inside edge of the support post. Repeat this mark on each end of the between post suspension bracket. Extend the lower end of the mark onto the gutter side of the support post on each post. Measure up from the top of the gutter hanger to the mark on the support post. Note this measurement. It indicates the height of the lower gutter flashing. Repeat on each end. Measure and mark from the folded side of the lower gutter flashing to indicate its height on both ends. Cut the gutter flashing to its proper height. Trim the lower gutter flashing to fit against the suspension wall channel on either end of the gutter. Attach the lower gutter flashing to the support posts. The upper gutter flashing's length is the same as the between post suspension bracket or the distance between the support posts. Square and mark the upper gutter flashing to its proper length. Measure the distance from the fold in the between post suspension bracket to the inside edge of the lower gutter flashing. Add one and one half inches to that measurement. Cut the upper gutter flashing to length. Cut the long side to the measurement you just made, remembering to add the one and one half inches to that measurement. Notch the edge of the upper gutter flashing for insertion into the fold of the between post suspension bracket. Insert the notched edge of the upper gutter flashing into the fold on the between post suspension bracket. Engage the notch in the between post suspension bracket. You may wish to drive a gutter screw to hold the upper gutter flashing in position on the lower gutter flashing. Shorter pieces will probably not flex enough to make this necessary. Seal the top edge of the lower gutter flashing and the top edge of the upper gutter flashing. Smooth and water test the sealant. Attach a corner cap to the inside of the deck structure on both sides of the downstream or gutter side of the underdeck. Bend the corner cap downward to ensure that water flows away from the deck structure. Seal, smooth, and water test the corner cap. The gutter flashing and corner cap installation is repeated on the opposite end of this span and at every support post on your project.